What's up, that's way to she girl joy back with another thing. Oh, I just ran up the stairs, child. Woo! Okay. I was recording and recording a video. And I'm on my phone because I'm having technical difficulties with my camera. Hopefully that'll be fixed by this weekend. <laughs> so if I need to upload a video, I have to do it on my camera and then download it to my computer. Anyway, whew, before I get started on this video, please give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, share, other parents who are going through similar things. I am work in progress. <sighs> Many of you have who have been supporting me for a while now or have gone back and look at the history of my videos and blah 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 you've learned who i am you've learned my heart you know what my passions are with my kids with my students blah 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 so you know the other person but those who are just coming in and passing judgment i'm like whoa <laughs> um so you're judging me based on 10 minutes like i don't talk to my son like i haven't talked to him for 18 years like i haven't tried with him for 18 years like I haven't sat him down there is a video if you want to go back I sat down Clint what do you want to do how about this how about this come on Clint because this is important you're almost about to graduate high school come on Clint come on Clint. blah 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 I don't know I don't know I don't know and there's a lot you guys don't see off camera so anyway just to give the update on the aftermath so his first day not productive what'd you do Oh, nothing, you know, just walked around, blah, blah, blah. And when I say I kicked him out, I kicked him out for the day, in the daytime. Go look for a job. Do something productive. What's wrong with that? When we come home, you come home. Just like we get up, you get up and go. What is wrong with that? I don't understand. So I'm just supposed to keep him in a sling and keep babying him? I, like I said, I'm not the perfect mother. I make mistakes. My life is far from perfect. I tell you guys that all the time. I know how to make some lemonade. I make good lemonade too. I make strawberry lemonade because, you know, I got so many limits. I got to get creative with the limits that I have, child. So, yes, just because I don't think or do the things that you do, then that makes me a bad person. Why? We all have different life experiences. Anyway, I'm working on a few negative people, small-minded negative people. I'm learning with this YouTube thing not to focus on the few negative, small-minded people <laughs> and focus on the so the many, many, many who have embraced this experience, this life experience, and, you know, encouraged me and blah, blah, blah. Life happens, but it's like you get to a point where you're fed up. One of them was like, when I tell my child something, they do it the first time. Your kid is lazy because that's how you raise them. Okay, but I just want to show you something. People like love to pass judgment, and after this, I'm done with the negative people. It's my channel. They will say, oh, so you got an attitude? I responded, yeah, I have a right to, to, to comment back, and if I don't like your comment, then fine. I think there's a way to comment and be respectful about the comment, and if I don't like it, just like you don't like what I do, you say what you said, so I said what I said, period. Block, delete, then get off my channel. Period. P point blank. Period. Period. Point, point blank. Anyway, but until you see these shoes that I have in the shadow box, these holy worn shoes, until you walked in my shoes, until you have walked in these shoes, please don't judge me. Until you have face death until you have faced the prospect of homelessness until you have faced not knowing how you're going to feed your kids and trying to make ends meet what did i say until you walked in these shoes these crusty beat up shoes where i never want to forget where i came from don't ever judge me for a 10 minute video you don't know what I've done for my kids. You don't know how much I've put in. Yeah, I'm not going to do everything that you do. I don't have that support system 
my mom was mad cool with me. She was mad chill. So I'm quite sure I have some of that baggage on me. I'm a mad cool, mad chill mom. Maybe I've made a lot of mistakes. I know I have, but I'm not you. I know I, what I've done for my kids. And I know I've been their cheerleader. I know I've been their best friend when I had to listen to them and give them advice and encourage them. Do you know that there are some minister kids who are complete mess ups? So you saying that those ministers didn't do everything they could for their kids? That's what you're saying? Parenting is not easy and there is no book. You can do everything there is for your child. And you got a Jeffrey doll. You didn't know. You got the bully at school. And you didn't know. You got the one who likes to sleep around. And you didn't know. You didn't teach them that mess. So should we blame you for that? No. At some point, they have their own mind. They want to do what they want to do. Because I know. I try to live by example. I like them to see me studying when I was in college. I wanted them to see me reading books and this and that. I took them to the library so much that they hate the library now. I read to them so much I could recite certain books without looking at the words. So until you can walk in these shoes and my experiences never pass judgment on a parent who's trying their best. That's my advice for you and people, whatever. So I got that out the way. I just had to get that out the way. Cause people, 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 uh, what is that? You better Google me, boo. You better Google me, boo. You better find out. Literally, you can Google me, boo. <laughs> so anyway, so, you know, it just irritated me. I'm sorry, I just had to get that off my chest. Now, now it's gone. I got the haters off of me. The haters. I got to get the haters off of me. So anyway, here is the aftermath of me kicking Clinton out in the daytime. Not the nighttime, the daytime. So it's wrong for me saying, go get a job, go figure it out in the daytime. I, I don't know if I can live with the nighttime. I, I'm, I'm not that gangster. But no, when we're getting up, going to work, going to school, doing stuff. No, you need to get up and go to find a job and do stuff. Trust me, there's some things I, I did that I'm not proud of too. But I did it for the sake of my kids and they didn't know what I did. They were protected from what I had to do to survive. They don't know. They don't know half the stuff. Do what I had to do. Still doing what I gotta do. Not easy, but it just sounds like people are just something else so quick to say stuff. But I wouldn't do that. I this. That's you. Good for you. Good for you. Good for you. Anyway, I got to go make spaghetti. And it's going to be thin spaghetti until I get paid. <laughs> I do what I got to do to feed these kids. I'm good with a little ramen and go to bed, honey. But, you know, as a mom, I'm, I'm going to make the meal stretch. <laughs> I'm going to do what I got to do <laughs> to provide and feed my kids. Yes, it's, it's, we tight. We tight this, this, this week. We tight. We trying to hold on to a payday. You know, I just had to cough up over $3,000, over, over $3,000 for this new new roof we got over here. Because, you know, you got your security, your deposit, the this, the this. You got all that. So, up front, you, you got up up front, you got to pay all that. Anybody, you know, so that that's, I did what I had to do, right? So, it is what it is. So, if I'm telling my son to get up and go get a job. And you don't agree? Uh, unsubscribe or don't subscribe. Click off. Don't leave your nasty comments. Just go somewhere. Goodbye. And you with your perfect life. That's what you do. Because your life is so perfect. You do everything right. You never have any problems. You never have any struggles. Your kids are so perfect. Miss me with that. Go ahead with your perfect life. Just click off and keep going. But my life's not perfect. Anyway, I just heard somebody. Hello, who's there? Hey, Bobby. You say hi, Bobby. 
Huh? How's school going, Bobby? It's a stressful thing in my life. <laughs> it's hard. You see? It's hard. Then why would I go on and add a good, you got to get a job. No, I would like more help in the kitchen. She Out of the kids, she's the only one that will cook. But she doesn't realize that when I cook, I clean up my mess too. And when she cooked the other day, I cleaned up her mess. Because I didn't I, ask her to, though, just to make that known. But I knew you had a lot of schoolwork, and I was tired with my swollen ankle. I do that. I, I got a job, though. I'm going to make, like, $30 this week. Like, 40 I'm going to make $40 this week. Bobby swing. has yeah. a job as a tutor. She tutors for the school math, right? Mm -hmm. Well, I tutor everything. It, it's not really official. Once again... And this is my repetitive moment. So when a when a writer or author or speaker says something repeatedly, they want you to think about that. With these ratchet shoes, beautiful little daughter. Does she do everything perfect? Do I do everything perfect for her? No. Beautiful little girl. Clinton's a beautiful little boy. We just got to keep working on Clinton. Sydney, beautiful little girl. Still working on Sydney. <laughs> We still, we, I'm still working on me. Shoot. I'm still working on myself. Shoot. I'm far from, I'm, boo. And these kids are still, they, these kids could be worse. Mm -mm, miss me with that. Straight A student taking college level classes in high school. What you in the 10th grade now? Bye. <laughs> I'm a junior. Oh, okay. Oh, Look, you, know, you know, I got too much on my brain. 11th grade. Taking college courses. Which course are you taking, Bobby? History. History. Did you get some tomato sauce? Yeah. Okay. I was gonna... Okay, it'll be some thin spaghetti, but we'll be okay. We got some meat, though. Put a, in it. We don't got no bread in it. I like bread with my spaghetti. Anyway, <laughs> I'm a mukbang that sucker spaghetti. So, anyway, here we go. Yeah. These kids work. Worse. They can be way worse. They're wonderful kids. Wonderful. So say what you want because I told him to get up to go get your life during the day. <gasps> what about when the kid goes out the side and play all day? They leave. They, they don't come back to the, 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 to the street lights. Come on. That makes him a bad parent. But no, I tell my son to get up and get your tail out and go figure out your life in the daytime. That makes me a bad. Anyway, let me go calm down. Because this video is long. I don't care. Click off. Piss me off. Hey, beautiful little kid. Get on my nerves, though. What, Bobby? Period. Point blank, period. My kid. My period. students. My students love when I'm in, I'm in this bathroom. I'm going to have to figure out new lighting. No, this lighting is good. <laughs> but you the like shadow that. from. I get shadow. <laughs> so I get the shadows on my face. Whatever. So anyway, that is my update. That's my update. Did you did you hear from Clint? No, no, no. What he said. And the iPad's not here. The iPad is here. The iPad is here. Yeah. Did he take it with him this morning? I don't know what Clint did. Oh, did you not take him with you? Oh, you didn't get the update. You gotta watch the video. My kids don't oh, like to watch my videos. I don't even watch anybody else's YouTube. When I tell y'all, I don't got time for nothing anymore. <laughs> right, because what's gonna happen? You gotta focus on your schoolwork because your friends are not gonna be there to help you take your SAT, your PSAT, ACT, MCAT, G, all those G, whatever, all those acronyms. So you focus and focus on what you have to do, and not worry about your social life. That'll come later, in a couple of years. <laughs> I gotta have my social life with me. <laughs> You got to have straight A's too. How about that? I'm trying. And another thing. I know y'all going to be clicking off. That's all right. Oh, well. And another thing. My mom gave my brother and sister and I all the same opportunities. All the same. So, would somebody say my mother was a bad mother? Because my older brother and sister didn't finish school. But I did. I did. So, was she a bad mom because the other two didn't work out? In the educational abandonment. So, does it make her a bad mom? Which is all different. You think your child's so perfect. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And want to pass judgment. Give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, share, and subscribe.